Are you entertained by the chaos of reality TV dating shows? Do you appreciate honest and realistic queer representation? Are you tired of ridiculousness? Ridiculousness. Yo, this kid falls right the hell off his bunker. Well then, MTV, we have the show for you. Introducing Sapphic Summer, a new reality dating show featuring women who love women. Sapphic Summer will include all your favorite parts of your favorite reality TV shows, like the drama of Love Island, the challenges and rewards of Survivor, and the fan and audience dedication of The Bachelor, but with gay women. Sapphic Summer would be perfect for MTV because of MTV's history of successful reality TV shows like Jersey Shore, Teen Mom, and the classic The Real World. MTV has also been a channel with more queer personalities with their show Are You The One, but mostly no more ridiculousness. Sapphic Summer will air two days a week and the episodes will include all the excitement and drama since the last episode was aired. The show will be recorded and aired over about three months in the summer from late May to late August and the episodes will go like this. The first episode will be a special two-hour event that will include the introduction of the first 16 contestants and their first challenge, as well as an inside look at the rewards and activities they will be a part of. By the end of the season, we will bring in the final contestant's family, or their chosen family, to meet their new partner. If the family doesn't like their partner, the couple could be in danger for the finale, where the viewers and the live studio audience can vote for the couple who they think deserve to win love and one million dollars. About halfway through the season, there will be a twist. During the point where there's 10 contestants remaining, we will surprise them with their exes. They will become a part of the show and live with their exes. Some will have bad blood and may try to ruin their current connections, or some may be roommates and friends with their exes. It's all part of the drama. A challenge per episode will include testing their physical strengths as well as their mental strengths. The physical challenges will come and give them immunity. The contestants will also have challenges that will lead to winning a date. These challenges will include who knows who better and who said what during the season. In addition, each special elimination episode will include insights with the trained relationship expert and a surprise guest host. On the second episode of the week, people watching at home will have chances to vote for things happening live during the episode, like who stays, who leaves, or who comes back. This keeps our audiences and viewers engaged, and then they will want to watch the show live so they can have a say in their favorite contestants' fates. 16 contestants will be living in the glamorous tropical mansion on the islands of Fiji. From challenges to dates, these contestants will spend all their time on the beach enjoying the sun. During the voting ceremony, the contestants will meet within the mansion for deliberation. They will share the bedrooms in groups in a communal living style. There will also be a getaway room. With new contestants and returning favorites from some of your favorite reality TV shows, Sapphic Summer is sure to have big personalities and someone to keep you coming back to watch week after week. All new contestants will be selected through a casting process and returning TV show contestants will be personally reached out to by the Sapphic Summer casting team. Though Sapphic Summer is all about the entertainment and drama of the queer dating scene, we want our casting to be intentful and inclusive. We will be casting a variety of different individuals who have different backgrounds and experiences with being queer and dating. Sometimes, one reality show just isn't enough to meet your true match. Returning contestants from past reality shows will include Sammy Cimarelli from The Circle, Kira Green from Love Island USA, Amber Martinez from Are You The One?, Demi Burnett from The Bachelor, and Jenna Brown from Are You The One? You can't have a great reality TV show without an incredible host, and for that reason, Sapphic Summer's host is Kate McKinnon, a well-known actress, comedian, and out lesbian, best known for her comedic work on Saturday Night Live and The Big Gay Sketch Show. Not only would Kate McKinnon offer hilarious commentary and delivery throughout the entire season, but she would grab the attention of the queer audience and fan base to keep them returning week after week. We all know that if there's one thing sure to get the attention of the lesbian audience, it's celebrity heartthrobs. Our love experts are well-known LGBTQ celebrities and pop culture icons who have influenced the community in a positive and transformative way. New experts will be brought on each week to help guide the contestants into finding a meaningful connection while in the mansion. In addition, the inclusion of the celebrities will create more hype surrounding the show and help it gain a larger audience. Some of our amazing love experts will include people like Sarah Paulson, Lena Waithe, Haley Kiyoko, India Moore, Hannah Gadsby, Samira Wiley, and Katherine Monig. 
Sapphic Summer provides a great opportunity for plenty of sponsors and products who can find great times for advertisements during commercial breaks like the dating apps Her and Tammy and U-Haul. Our target audience for Sapphic Summer is queer women and reality TV show fans aging from 18 to 45. In order to really maximize our exposure, we plan to advertise across social media platforms including TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube. In addition, our team will also reach out to famous queer social media influencers and personalities who will be paid to create specific content and promote Sapphic Summer on their channels and accounts. The main costs of the show include things like housing, compensation for host and guests, rewards and excursions, production crew, and food and living expenses. By allotting a max budget of around $2 million per episode, the entire first season can be made with a budget of approximately $60 million. Thank you, and we hope you decide to tune in and join us in paradise for Sapphic Summer.